Hey guys, so I am going to throw together a quick little low carb dinner recipe inspired by a recipe I found off Pinterest. Um, we're going to use a pound of ground beef, mild diced tomatoes with green chilies, shredded cheddar, peppers, onions, taco seasoning, and instead of rice, we're going to use cauliflower. I'm going to get this going in the skillet. Got the peppers and onions, sauteing in um, olive oil in this skillet, and when these get a little more done, we'll put the hamburger meat in there. Add your hamburger meat. I'm going to fry up some eggs over here to put in the puppy's food with some veggies. Not part of the recipe. That's for the puppy's dinner. Okay, that's done. I've got a bag of cauliflower that I just nuked in the microwave for seven minutes. I'm going to dump this in here. This is instead of rice. We're going to dump in a can of mild diced tomatoes with green chilies. Oh, there it is. Holding it way up here where you couldn't see it. You can make this as spicy as you want. I don't do spicy. Get this going. Oh. It's about right. Rice bowl. Start up. Chop up this cauliflower a little bit so it's a little bit easier to handle. I did add salt and pepper and garlic and you know some extra seasonings besides the taco seasoning. I preheated my oven to 350 the usual. Now y'all can use rice if you want to. even use cauliflower rice and I had some in my bag and then I was like nope we're gonna use just cauliflower because there's something to bite into you know and I love cauliflower so this is a Mexican cheesy rice recipe that I just am making low carb so What I'm going to do is I'm just going to leave it in the skillet and then I'm going to smother it with cheese and we're going to put it in the oven and let the cheese get melty schmelty. And you can eat on this for a few days because with this cauliflower in here it's going to be very filling. seasoning in there. He has to blend. And we're just going to put the whole skillet in the oven uncovered.
here I am. <laughs> Just gonna put the whole thing in the oven. Set the timer for 20 minutes. 20 minutes. I'm just guessing 20 minutes. We'll be back. Okay, guys, it is ready. Hot now. Don't you love a meal you can just make in a cast iron skillet? I love it as much as a crock pot. Okay, we're gonna get this plated up. Shane wants to put sour cream on his, and I probably do too. Looks good. Okay, got it plated up. Isn't that good? Yum. Shane said it was good. He's in the living room. He's tired. He don't want to be on camera right now. He don't want to be on camera. Okay. Put a little salt on it. Put some sour cream on it. Let's see. Let's see what we got. Well, if I can get it on the fork. I didn't follow an exact recipe. I just saw a recipe and got inspired by it and did my own thing. That's good. That's good. Yeah. Yum. So instead of rice, use cauliflower. Use grass-fed beef, tomatoes, peppers, onions, cheese, all that good stuff. Mm -hmm. mm. It's good. It needs a little more salt. Pepper. A little more. I always have a tendency to under salt and pepper things because you can always add more, right? But once you put too much salt on something, there's not really any going back. Okay, quick, easy, throw together recipe. Um, I'd make it again. It's good. Okay, I love you guys. The Lord loves you more. See you in the next video.